Hello friends, welcome to ASF Tutorials. I am Afnan Pasha. We are going to study and analyze using Comsi Multiphysics the different eigenfrequencies on a cantilever beam. Now first we are going to click on model wizard window. Since the cantilever beam is a 3D object, I will just click on 3D and choose structural mechanics under structural mechanics and choose solid mechanics solid and click add and wait till it get computed then press study here in select study choose eigenfrequency since I have earlier mentioned we are doing the concept based on eigenfrequency and press done It is better if we choose our unit in micrometers. Then I have to give my parameters. So I'll right click definition and choose my parameters. The first parameter which I'm going to use is beam length. And I'll give it as 300 micrometer. Next is beam width. I'll give it as beam W with its value as 40 micrometers and beam height given by beam h as y8 micrometers since my parameters are ready i'm going to build a block so that i'll right click geometry and press block in this for the block width as i have earlier given the parameters we'll just enter the parameter name that is beam width for width for depth i'll give beam length and for height I'll give beam height so just click on build all objects so that your beam is ready with your length as 300 mm and width as 40 mm and height as 8 mm uh, sorry 8 micrometer now after this I should add a material so just click on add materials in this add material go under built in choose material as silicon this is your silicon material and click add to selection our material is added since your material is added just choose your whole material again press add material so that your add material window will close now I have to give some fixed constraint so I'll right click solid mechanics and click on fixed constraint and choose body to only after this just build the mesh so that right click mesh and click build all since our mesh is ready I'll just right click study and click compute our program is getting computed this is the obtained graph of eigenfrequency here we have two parameters that is minimum displacement and maximum displacement since we are studying for different eigenfrequencies there are six different eigenfrequencies just choose other eigenfrequency and click plot that other graph is obtained again choose another eigenfrequency and click plot one more eigenfrequency displacement graph is obtained choose another frequency and click plot one more eigenfrequency displacement plot is obtained you can choose eigenfrequency click plot other with some different shape it's looking like a snake then we'll click plot and choose another eigenfrequency and it's doing a color stretch now as we see we got different different maximum frequency for different eigenfrequency plots so just analyze all the six plots and choose which is maximum among all the three displacements so your minimum displacement will be zero and maximum displacement will be the highest maximum displacement out of the six plots i hope every, uh, we have understood if you have not yet subscribed our channel please do subscribe for updates be updated thank you friends